Welcome back guys. Today I'll be showing you how to make um write an image for your pie. I don't know why any of you guys are paying for an image on eBay or even Amazon or anywhere on Facebook or in even a group. This thing should be free. Okay? It's free. All images are free. Nobody needs to pay for this. So that's why I'm making a video today that how to write an image the easy way, okay? Today I'm gonna uh, write an image, a new image just released. It's from DZ, 400 gigabyte. Gonna give it a test. Today is um, what you need, first of all, a, a flash USB. I use this, it's easy. Must have a little micro SD, okay, flash USB, 512, you can see it, 512, okay, any flash drive, I have another one here, all right, as long as there's a little slot for your micro, uh, micro SD, okay, first of all, what you do is, you pop this, you pop this in. Micro SD. I'll put in a link in the description for all your, uh, your flash drive, micro SD adapter, okay? Picture Desire, there's plenty on Amazon. Cheapest I've seen was like three bucks. A good one, decent one, $5. So I'm gonna plug it in 3.0 for faster uh, for faster writing your image, okay? I recommend 3.0, but regular is fine. I'll put it back here. Okay. Okay, my SD is in, which is the H drive, okay? What you do is Use SD for matter. Click yes. Make sure this on drive H. Okay. Quick format. Once that done. Exit out, you use WinDisk 32. I'll put in a link under a video description. Now make sure, see this device? Drive H, okay, you gotta make sure. Click on this folder. Look for the image where you just download it. It's free, Google, or YouTube is your best friend to find free image. RK Punks, Google RK Punks, you find it. So I'm gonna locate it where I save my image, okay? I save it on E drive where my external hard drive. Back up. Download. It's down here. Uh where is that image at? DZ King, no, here it is, no, where, no, where did I save that at? Hold on, here it is. See, the image looks like this, it looks like a little CD, okay? See that? You double click it, okay? Now all you gotta do is click right. Make sure it's on drive H. Click right, okay? And then, yes. That's it. Very easy and simple to do this method. It's nothing hard about it. And uh, this is a pretty, it's a pretty big file. Maybe about, about two and a half to three hours of writing this image, okay? Available at RK Punks, 
Google search, YouTube, all this is free. None of you guys should be paying for this, okay? Free image. Thank you for watching. I'll send on the link under the description and I'll be uh, showing this new image off in the next couple of days, okay? Thanks for watching, enjoy. Okay guys, it's all done. As you can see, uh, let me cancel this. Okay, uh, cancel. Right, successful. Press OK. It took me about three hours and almost, wow, almost four hours. Three hours, 51 minutes. Okay, because it's a big file. All right, let's click OK and uh, exit out. That's it, you're done. Put in your pie and test it out. All right, guys, I'm back with this new image. Today, I'm going to show you how to set your buttons correctly. I'm just going to hold any of these buttons, hold, hold down. So, to do it the right way, up. Now I'm going to go down. Now I'm going to click down. Then left. See, left. See it left and then right. So my start will be here. Start, select. Okay, A and then B. X Y and then uh, X. I'm clicking X. Then I'm clicking X. X, Y, okay, and then there's an L and R, so L here and R here, so here it is, L, R, that's all you need, now I skip all this, just hold down any, hold down any button, up to the next, Hold out any button. Then go to next. Okay, hot key. I'm gonna choose any of this button for hot key so they have extra buttons, okay? There's my hot key. So, A for okay. Just wait. Everything's done. Now I'm gonna show you guys how to get into Retro Arch for the uh, for the videos, your resolution, four by three, six by nine, everything, no no black borders, okay? All that, no black borders. We'll go back that out. Yes. Oh, oh no, okay, no. I'm gonna go back. Okay. I'm gonna go. There it is, RK. Looks like this. Alright. I don't know what game should I try. Uh, I don't even really know. Let's try Street Fighter, huh? You wanna skip all the way down to S? Click the select button right here. It'll pop up a menu. Scroll down to S. S for Street Fighter. Okay, shortcut. And I, the second button will be um. This is if you, this is a Street Fighter style. This so this is as a forward kick, forward kick. Click that to enter. So all the S. No, what am I going? Okay. What is this? What's R K? Okay. For Street Fighter, I'm a Street Fighter fan. There it is. I don't know. 
Let's try uh, Street Fighter Strike. Enter. Okay, slow it up. Okay. You see all this pixelated? Pixelated? Okay. I'm gonna fix all that. I don't like pixelated games. Some of you may like it, and some of you don't. Okay. Okay. I'm gonna show you today how to get into Retro Arch. Okay. Look at all that. Pixelated, right? You see that? Very pixelated. I'm gonna get rid of this. Okay, the bezel. So this is my hotkey, medium punch, okay? I'm using one hand, I gotta use my knee. Hotkey and medium punch. You see that? Red jar came up. Now, this is where you go. You go to screen overlay. Scroll down. Screen overlay. This is enter, medium kick, Street Fighter style, enter. Display screen overlay, off. Okay, this is go back. Okay, now you go to shaders for smooth graphics. Shaders, same thing. Enter. Load shader preset. Okay, same thing. Enter. I like this, this third one here. Two X scales. Okay, the third two X. Okay, I must pick that. You can try out everything. But I like this is the best. Two X scale, enter. Okay. And uh, apply changes. Enter again. Once you're done, you click go back. This is back. Okay. Back. Okay. And then override. Go down to override. Never save core overrides. Okay. Never. Don't do that. Save game or right or save contact directly. Okay, I'm gonna save that. I'm gonna save game too. Do both, but never save core. Okay, now you click back. See that back? I'm gonna click back again. This is the short, the short kick back. Then I click on a quick menu. Okay, Res resume the game. Look how smooth that is. You see the graphics. See? Bezel free. Bezel free. No black borders. Right. I'm gonna go to another game as an example. I'm gonna exit. I'm gonna press hot key and start at the same time to exit the game, okay? Here it is. I'm gonna do it with my knee. Hot key and start. Yeah. This is supposed to be start. I supposed to switch I supposed to switch these two buttons around. Okay? Try a different game. Uh, okay. Spider Man, four players. Okay. Credit. And uh, start. Look at this. Very pixelated. We're going to do it again. I'm going to show you one more time. And we're going to fix the screen again. Okay. Pick my players. See that? Now, same thing. Hot key, medium punch. I'm doing my knee because I'm recording with one hand. Okay. Go down to uh, screen overlay. Remember that? Screen overlay. Enter. Display. Overlay on, right? So turn it off. Okay. Now kick back. Shaders. Smooth graphics. Load. Shaders preset. Okay, enter. I like the third one. I try. I haven't tried them all yet, but this is by far the best one. Very smooth graphic. Like I say, I don't like uh, pixelated games. Now you see this four by three. Okay, you click back. Go to click back again. Go to settings under setting. 
Okay, there is setting. Videos. Go to aspect ratio, okay? Go down. I'm gonna scroll my stick to the right to change the aspect ratio, okay? Look. Keep going, four by three, 16 by nine, you see? 16 by nine, that's perfect. Back, and back again. Go to quick menu. I hate to do this all the time, but it's, it's a pain, but, okay, I'll click enter. Override, save contact directly, over, o override, enter, and save game override, okay? Now, go back, back, quick menu, resume, enter again. Look how smooth that is. Look at that. Smooth graphic using shaders this is called shaders this this two version of uh, retro arch the green one is the old one it's easier to operate and there's another one there's a blue one of a retro arch but it's same thing it's just it looks like a psp style as a background the blue retro arch this is a green old retro arch and there's a blue one assets the same thing back forward left right same thing no difference okay very smooth Okay, yes, that's a good uh, tutorial for, for all you guys. Hopefully uh, this helps out. Very smooth graphics, okay? Very smooth. Everything's running good. No lag. Okay, okay. Shaders, shaders is the best. I love shaders. I don't like uh, pixelated games. Very smooth, you see that? Nice and smooth. Okay, look at that. All fixed. Hope you guys enjoyed this video. Please give me a thumbs up. Share on my channels. And positive comments only. Thank you guys and thank you for watching.